Hello. How many years have you been under stress? How many years have we been under stress? Intense stress over time creates fixed patterns of tension in your body, which can build up to insane levels, causing all types of mental and physical ailments. Intense stress, such as a pandemic, lockdown, loss of a job, hospitalization, addiction, divorce, death of a loved one, surgery, or a high-pressure lifestyle can strain the entire nervous system so that it cannot function. At some point, we arrive at critical mass where there is so much built up, it's time to clear the slate and leave it all behind. But how can you reach down inside to release those hidden unconscious patterns of holding anxiety and fear? Releasing deep pent up stress patterns in the brain, muscles and organs is not going to happen by taking a nap or even a vacation. Speaking with a therapist or a friend can be helpful. However, stress in the body is held physically. So the solution is also physical. We can't talk our way out of in these deep physical habits. And to analyze what happened can't resolve your stress patterns. Stress buildup is just about your reactions and holding on to them. A pattern of fear in the nervous system is sometimes called PTSD. We all carry post-traumatic stress disorder to some extent. Stress over time sets up a muscular network of apprehension and fear that never leaves us. Depending upon the stress level of your childhood and your life in general, I guarantee you're carrying a measure of PTSD right now, which is an unconscious memory of fear and fight flight in your body all the time. Maybe something traumatic happened to you. Maybe it's fate, maybe destiny, it's hard to know. It may not be your fault, but it is your responsibility to deal with it. And your response to it is the key. Your reactions accumulate and stay locked up inside you. This is your choice. So in theory, it is 100% under your control. We like to apply our linear thinking to try to resolve life issues, but they're not simple. They're actually wonderful gifts. We have to move beyond the linear thinking of the mind to unravel the subtle counterintuitive solutions. And that is the beautiful paradox of life, that you sort of have to discover the keys to your own cage, which is beyond the mind. So when we solve even one of these problems, it's a huge victory. We learn something, and that particular issue never appears again in our existence, ever. To try to reason our way out of emotional states as we experience them is something like talking to a child in the middle of a tantrum. Living mindfully means observing yourself in the moment. This is the path to wholeness, and you are the only one that can do it. The human nervous system has two modes. It's either in relaxed mode or it's in stress mode. In relaxed mode, you feel good. You're comfortable with the people around you. You're positive and calm. But in stress mode, your body is always wary in defensive watchfulness, ready for fight or flight. Many people are locked in stress mode 100% of the time. It becomes a self-created cage of tension and unhappiness. These two modes are sometimes called the parasympathetic and the sympathetic nervous system, but I prefer simple words. So you're either in relaxed mode or stressed mode. 
This six-step technique is designed to be a key to help you unlock your own unconscious patterns of whatever it is you carry to relax deeply beyond the mind. When your holding patterns dissolve and melt away, you can have a beautiful life right now. Taking loving care of yourself is a huge priority. Relaxing allows you to find the hidden key to open the latch and be free. Soon, you may find your whole world view is different. A total attitude change. Doing this yourself a few minutes a day costs nothing and can reset your nervous system back to its original blueprint of health. How wonderful will it feel to let go of that old way of being? There are six steps. The first step is baking soda to oxygenate the brain and reverse blood acidity because fear and panic are rooted in brain acidity. Step two is alternate nostril breathing to balance the brain cortices and calm the nerves. The third step is a relaxing yoga movement of cat-cow to release the diaphragm which holds emotions. The fourth step activates kidney meridian which rules fight-flight patterns. We touch the eyes which are the window to the brain and tap to dissolve accumulated fear. The fifth step is an easy reset of the vagus nerve with eye movement which releases tension in every organ. What is the vagus nerve? The vagus nerve is the root of the two modes, relaxed versus stressed. The longest and most important nerve in your body, it zigzags through touching all vital functions like a two-way communicator between your brain and organs. It integrates the gut to the brain and connects all body intelligence. The vagus nerve helps us calm down, process, absorb. It regulates memories, social bonding, human connection. But when the vagus nerve endures long periods of chronic stress and tension, our whole body intelligence and linking system becomes numb, as if frozen. This numbness can reverberate tension in all the body systems, and even worse, it makes it impossible to digest life as a total person. A compromised vagus nerve might first show up as brain fog, depression, food allergies, or just feeling exhausted all the time. When the stress continues, a locked vagus nerve can be a major factor in a vast range of seemingly unrelated ailments, such as congestive heart failure, bipolar disorder, fibromyalgia, GERD, migraines, cancer, Alzheimer's, diabetes, blood sugar imbalances, adrenal and liver disorders, constipation, or alcoholism. No other nerve has such a broad and far-reaching effect as the vagus nerve. That is why today's technique leads directly to step five to the release of the vagus nerve, which you can reset naturally and painlessly. Each step helps to prepare the body to permanently shift into wellness. The sixth and final step is a, is a guided total body relaxation, which invites the whole nervous system to reset. All six steps take just a few minutes a day and the positive effects are cumulative, so they increase each time you do it. Depending on your personal level of stress, you might reset your nervous system in one day. For some people, it may take longer. The six steps are designed to be done together. However, you can do any step separately by yourself whenever you need. Now you are in the driver's seat to resolve so many issues in one complete tool. Are you ready to try? You'll need a half teaspoon baking soda, a little glass of water, a spoon to stir, 
and a yoga mat to lie down. Just press pause and come back when you're ready. Step one is baking soda. Place a half teaspoon baking soda in a little clean water. Stir it up and down the hatch. Oh, it's a little bitter. However, soon you will notice reduced stress in your body and brain. What's your intention today? How about asking for freedom and total wellness at every level? Just make your intention now. Step two is alternate nostril breathing to calm the mind. This balances the brain cortices and detoxes the whole body. Hold up your right hand, fold the index and middle fingers down like this. This leaves your thumb and fourth finger to control the breath. Inhale, then place your thumb over your right nostril. Exhale deeply to eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now inhale to eight, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now gently close your other nostril with your fourth finger. Exhale slowly. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now deep inhale slowly. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Change to your thumb and exhale. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale. Two three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now fourth finger close. Exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One more time. Exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now move to the fourth finger. Exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. You can repeat this three to five minutes until you feel calmness and clarity come into you. But I feel a huge change, like I'm actually a little bit sleepy and I could fall asleep pretty soon. And that's amazing because I'm making a video and I should be nervous. Step three is the yoga movement, cat cow, to deepen the breath Release the spine and the diaphragm, which is the root of emotions. On your hands and knees, inhale deeply as you arch your chest forward and up. On the exhale, arch the mid back up like a cat, bending the other way, core engaged gently. Repeat this six times. Inhale deeply as you arch your chest upward and forward. On the exhale, arch the mid back up like a cat, curving back up the other way. Inhale deeply again as you arch your chest and sternum forward. Exhale, arch the mid back up like a cat bending the spine upward the other way. Inhale again deeply as you arch your chest forward and up. 
exhale, arch the mid back up like a cat bending the back up the other way. Deepening your breath each time. Inhale deeply into the belly as you arch your chest upward. Exhale, curve the mid back up like a cat bending the other way. Last time, inhale deeply as you arch your chest forward. On this last exhale, move your buttocks back all the way down to rest near your feet. Take a few breaths here as you relax. Allow your spine and tailbone to expand and release completely. The fourth step activates the kidney meridian, the adrenals, and the brain's connection to fear. Take a deep breath. Use both hands to reach around and hold and massage your kidney behind you at the small of your back, at the waist level. Breathe here. Now touch your eyes softly for 10 seconds to Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now touch your two acupuncture points on your chest. These are the kidney 27 points. Let's see if I can find them right there. Underneath the collarbone, about three to four inches apart. Keep two fingers touching those K27 points. Breathe and use your other hand to tap gently first on the head, then on the heart, and then on your belly down by your navel. Breathe. This touches all the organ connections to dissolve fear. That's it. Good job. Now let's just breathe and do it again. Use both hands to reach around to hold and massage your kidneys behind you at the small of your back at the waist level. Now, breathe and touch your eyes softly for 10 seconds. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Now, find your kidney 27 points. Under the collarbone, three to four inches apart, touch them with two fingers and spread your hands and tap gently on the head, the heart, and the belly down by the navel. Good job. Step five is the vagus nerve reset. Lie comfortably on your back, head on a pillow, lace your fingers, and place them behind your head at the base of your skull and neck. Take a deep breath. In this exercise, your head faces upwards without moving. Your eyes will move to the side, but you will keep your head still and forward. Take a deep breath. Now turn your eyes to the right, looking to the three o'clock position and hold them there as you breathe normally for 10 to 30 seconds until you feel a shift in the nervous system. Hold your eyes there. A shift will be indicated by a yawn, a sigh or a swallow indicating the reset is complete. It may be subtle. Just stay there and hold your eyes to the right with your head facing forward. There it is, a yawn, sigh or swallow. Then move your eyes back to the center and breathe normally. Now turn your eyes to the left of the extreme nine o'clock position, keeping your head facing up to the ceiling. Breathe normally as you hold your eyes gazing left until you feel a shift in the form of a yawn, a sigh, or a swallow. It may feel slightly strange, but it is harmless. Hold anywhere 10 to 30 seconds until you feel a natural release. A yawn, sigh, or a swallow. Oh, there it is. Take a deep breath. You just reset your whole nervous system and your whole 
vagus nerve. Good job. The final step number six is total body relaxation. Lie down comfortably. Breathe deeply and use this time to enjoy letting go in every part of your body. Use your gentle mindfulness to send calm waves of light and loving care to each area of your body one at a time. This is the total recalibration of all the other steps. So go ahead and allow yourself to sink deeply into complete body rest. At this point in the six steps myself, sometimes I feel like I'm going to cry, which I suppose is a good sign that can even help wash out and dissolve old stuff. In this total relaxation, we will go through each body part mindfully to release it. You can do this by yourself anytime. Today, I will guide you through briefly so you can rest completely. When we finish, I'm going to leave you to relax by yourself for a few more minutes to the sound of the ocean waves. Okay? Bye-bye. You're lying down comfortably on your back. Allow your spine to be long, your shoulders open and chest open palms up, feet comfortably apart. Imagine yourself on a virtual beach, listening to the gentle waves. Be aware of the, the heavy parts of your body sinking into the earth and allow any tension or cloudiness from your entire body to dissolve and sink deeply into Mother Earth. Feel the heavy parts of your body as they touch the earth, your calves, your buttocks, your upper back, your shoulder blades, your shoulders and your head are sinking deeply. Heavier and heavier with each deep breath. Your only job right now is to be kind to yourself, to take care of yourself in a loving way to allow any tension that you don't need dissolve and disappear. Starting at the head, send waves of relaxing light to your head and feel your scalp your neck, your ears release, your forehead and your eyes. Release your lips completely of any holding. Your jaw can relax. Send waves of loving light into your neck. All your neck bones. Swallow. And allow that relaxation to move down into your chest. Feel your chest opening, your breath easy. Relax your collarbones, 
Relax your shoulder blades, your shoulder joints. Relax your upper arms, your biceps and triceps melting. Your lower arms, your wrist, and every finger starting with the thumb, sending relaxing waves to release the thumb and all fingers one, two, three, four, five. Now moving down your spine, relax your heart. Relax any holding around your heart, any tendencies to hold in your chest. Relax your breathing, your abdomen, relax your diaphragm underneath your lungs. Now relax your belly, let it go completely. Relax your buttocks and relax all your personal organs in that area. Let them completely be released. Oh, your upper legs, relax your thighs on the top of your leg and your hamstrings that are touching the earth. Relax the sides of your legs. Feel your hip joints. Release completely, no holding. Send warm breaths of light into your knees. Relax all the parts of the knees, the synovial fluid. Relax your shins. Relax your calves. Relax the bones of your legs. Relax your ankles, your ankle joints. And relax your tendons of your toes. Relax every toe. Starting with the big toes. One, two, three, four, five. Feel your whole body sinking deeply into the sand of your virtual beach. And now allow yourself to release your thoughts. No worries, you can pick them up later. as you breathe slowly and evenly. On each breath, allow your body, mind and spirit to sink deeply into oneness with Mother Earth and harmony, allowing your cares to drift away and dissolve. Now I invite you to take one more deep breath in and out and on each exhale, release deeper into your own beautiful personal relaxation. If there are any areas that I've forgotten, please take the opportunity to breathe light and love into those areas. And I will leave you here for as long as you wish to enjoy the ocean waves and release deeper and deeper every tension and every care. Releasing now.